the time has come. The finale of the hard path. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to part 9 of Star Fox. Venom, here we come. For the last time. Venom, the final goal. You've made it this far. It's your fate to destroy Andros. We're counting on you, Fox. I won't let you down, sir. Good luck. Same old stuff, but the only difference is, some of those missiles that come up, they actually... they come pretty fast. And as you can see, missile batteries to start. And look at that! Oh yeah, and those things, they're new. If these guys sit around long enough, they'll explode into five oval beams. And Lord knows we don't need any of those because they do just as much damage as the plasma walls. Then again, I find they're easier to avoid. Gotcha. And we got ourselves a little garrison of battleships. Ow! That bastard actually hit me! Oh well. That didn't do too much damage. Get out of here. Hang on! Oh no. Worst possible time. The Triforce. Alright, we're all good. Shoot it down, shoot it down. Oh good, it didn't explode. Everybody get out of my way. Spinning cartwheel, down. More missiles, another exploding thing. Huh? Something exploded. Did I shoot something? Okay, the thing is, there's an invisible missile battery there. I must have got lucky. Hold your horses! And it's in the worst possible spot, right before a checkpoint. Get out of here! Alright, we're doing fine. The missiles are still coming. And we've got the big battleships again. This is nothing. We've seen it all. We've done it all. What's possibly waiting for us at the end? Well, I do know, but... I'm going to keep that as a bit of a surprise for those who may not have seen this game. All one of you. Man, I am really getting bad with getting these missile batteries down before they explode into five missiles. But then again, it's not like I'm really shitting the bed here, so yeah. Still got my shield, which is good. Oop, not good. Couple of hits. Not the end of the world. Still got my shield. And it looks like the enemies are letting up. Finally, some peace and quiet. And here's the boss. It's... two bosses. One's just spinning around shooting lasers. And the other one's throwing garbage at me. And now there's a third thing just spinning in circles. They'll come together and form the ultimate battle machine. Say hello to the Great Commander. This is widely regarded as one of the toughest boss fights in the entire game. But look at this health bar. Seems like a joke. But believe me, he's no joke. This thing is tough to kill and even more dangerous if you don't know what to do. Me? This is why I've been saving all my Nova Bombs! I think I got one of them. I'll have to be a little better with my aim. I'm also going to try and take some pot shots at the open spots. Nice! Shot down another one. You miss me! Hopefully a well-placed Nova Bomb can take out multiple spots. The six glowing things, those are the weak points. Did that not do anything? Wow. It didn't. Okay, I'm doing damage, but the panels aren't breaking. I'm gonna have to get better with my use of the Nova Bombs. And I've only got three left. Bingo! Now that was a good chunk of damage. 
but with three gone, the thing starts to smoke, and now it's launching plasma balls. Okay, that didn't do squat. And I've got one Nova Bomb left. I'm gonna have to put it to really good use. I wish I may, I wish I might, I hope to take you down tonight! Okay, five out of six. Now this is where the men and the boys separate. I'm not expecting to hold onto my shield going into the next level, but that's fine because I can actually get another shield. Not quite. I did land a couple of hits here and there, but it's still alive and kicking. Open up! Got it! I'm kind of surprised. Usually I can get this guy down faster than that. Not that it matters, because in the long run, I win. Game? Oh, there we go. I don't know why, but at that point, there's always that little delay. And it's not all the time, it's kind of random. Some days, as soon as Great Commander leaves the screen, we go to this. Other times, about five seconds of waiting. Oh yes. Worthy of a perfect score. Back on the surface once again. It's just like the easy path, but there are a lot more obstacles, and it's far more dangerous. Just stay near the top, and you'll be fine. But at the very end, there's one standing upright, so get ready to dodge. Looky here. A shield. Okay, that was pretty stupid of me. Got it. Alright. Now let's kick some venom butt. More of the cheese sticks, and they're on the move. They get in my way, I melt them down. But you gotta watch out because there are some that are standing right there, and they'll fall to the side. Just be very careful, don't take any unnecessary risks, and you'll be just fine. But we're just getting started. You're welcome, Slippy. Okay, now we're doing good. Sweet! Shot him down. Who's next? Come on. Ah, oh, more of these things. Shoot them to change the direction. Standard stuff. Whoa! Split second movement. Talk about lucky. Okay, we're good. Oh, that was lucky shooting. Hang on, I got him. Yeah, you're welcome. Move it, move it! Oh, good. I made it. Yeah, so as you can see, there's a lot going on here. And that guy missed me. Good. How you holding up, Slip? Oh, wait, you're peppy. My goodness, it's like I'm getting tunnel vision or one-track mind or something like that. I don't know. Must be all the paint fumes at the new job. Ha! You missed! Really? Again? Well, I guess since you ask nicely, I'll do it. Okay, here comes Spider Brain. Take him out. Okay, one hit, that's not a big deal. Still got my shield. And we're getting close to the end. Yeah. Not a lot of trouble. Get these guys down. And for some reason, that one enemy, I can't shoot it down. I've tried so many times, can't get him. And he gets out of the way for the big boss. Great Commander, version 2. Kind of looks like nothing happened to him. But he's back with a vengeance. This time, instead of battleship mode, he transforms into a mock Megazord, and he's got a much bigger life bar. But with hyper lasers, you can destroy him rather quick. Just shoot the bottom panel as fast as you can, and watch out for the iron balls he shoots. 
He'll also launch missiles, so be very careful. And it looks like my shield's gone. Now it's bound to happen. Not that I care, because let's face it. I'm going to have this guy down in no time. When he does this, things are going to get really dangerous. Okay, the bottom part's gone. And we're on to phase two. Okay, I could swear that guy didn't hit me. Now for the ultimate kill shot. Shoot the head. And that's that. Get over here. Done like dinner. Great commander is no more. And not so great if you think about it. But make no mistake. Anything less than hyper laser, and you'll have a bit of trouble. I always do. And now it's Andros's turn to feel my wrath. One more with feeling. Ah! Your choice of roots took me by surprise! Your father was a reckless fighter too! Yeah, where do you think I learned it from? This is the most dangerous of all the hallways. Pretty good, pretty good! Okay, not my best. Okay. Kinda shit the bed there, but I'm still in pretty good shape. Three quarters of life. Wings intact, and my lasers. But this will be the McLeod's last battle! You're right, Andros. Because one way or another, it's over. And considering that I'm still a young pup, well, not really, I don't like your chances of survival. Nothing new here, at least not yet. Just watch out. If you have less than hyper lasers, your shots will bounce back at you. Just like in the medium path. Dodge the blocks, shoot the eyes, and I think you know what to do. Okay, that was a good dodge. Come on, pop hole. Okay, one eye down. And I don't think I have to shoot this eye too much more. Just got to do a little bit of dodging, and I should be fine. Come on, turn blue. Thank you. Okay, there we go. And now to take out the trash. Come on. Down with Andros! Okay. Now we get to see Andros' true form in this game. Andros is the devil himself. And now we launch his plasma balls. A very dangerous attack. They can home in on you, but barrel rolling can reflect them. Watch out for the blocks. Keep shooting, and you should be fine. And given all the damage I've given, I should be able to take him out as soon as the head breaks. Alright, there we go. Come on, big ugly. Take your lumps like a man. For the third and final time, that's game! And now to make my final grand exit. Come on, Fox. Punch it! Never give up. Trust your instincts. It's going up in flames. Mission accomplished. Now to rally up the wingmen. Sounds good, guys. Let's rock. When Andros declared war, he never thought that anybody would oppose him like Star Fox did. They came, they saw, they conquered. Fox McCloud, Falco Lombardi, Peppy Hare, and Slippy Toad have stepped up to the ultimate challenge, met and exceeded all expectations, and finally, at long last, peace is forever. And now to take a look at my scores. Not too crazy about the one in the asteroid belt, but I never do that well. 99% in Sector Z. Close, but no cigar. But then again, with all the hundreds I've got, I should be happy. And I am happy, knowing that I'm actually finished the game. Well, not entirely. There are a couple of things to take care of. One of them being the final enemy roll call. 
and the other being the bonus video, but we'll cross that bridge when we get there. 97% average on the hard path. That's pretty damn good if I'm going to be perfectly honest. Thanks, Chief. I think it's time for Star Fox to go on vacation. Lord knows they've earned it. And now, for the most unique enemy roll call of the game. The Hard Path. This happy fella, the Destructor. Like I've said before, not too much more troublesome than the Attack Carrier. The Blade Barrier. Looks mean and menacing, but not a problem. In fact, he's kind of a pushover if you think about it. Especially if you know how to dodge the web attack. Ah, this thing. Gave me a lot more trouble than I was expecting. But yeah, it's kind of a pain in the ass, if I'm going to be perfectly honest. All I can say is, keep a cool head, and you'll be fine. The only unoriginal boss, the Atomic Base 2, or as it's known in the manual, the Invasion Troop Carrier. The fact that the barriers can regenerate, a nice addition, and an annoying one at that. But still, a boss is a boss. And speaking of lame bosses, this thing starts off really lame. I mean, just look at it. It's spinning around and spitting plasma. The spinning core. Of course, when it gets to its second phase, then you know business is picked up. And don't even get me started about how much I hate this bastard. Wasted all my Nova bombs on this thing. Of course, got the job done. And it's a good thing I dropped this version of Great Commander when I did. Because if you go too long into the spinning arm phase, you gotta really dodge the iron balls. Because it sends a lot at you. As for Andros, I tip my hat to my rival. You've given me a good challenge, but of course, the better man won. See you next time, in whatever game I challenge you in. And now for my final thoughts on Star Fox. I love this game. I'm not gonna lie, it was kinda tough when I was growing up because, like most of us, didn't have a damn clue what I was doing. I can remember first playing this game after renting it at the store. I lost so many wings and got shot down so many times. I, oops, sorry about that. Anyway, as I was saying, lost so many wings, got shot down so many times, I thought this game was impossible to beat. Naturally, as years went on, I got better at it and learned the ins and outs. Now, for that last little bit of business, there's one more secret level, and I'm going to show that in the next video. And once I do, that's it. Star Fox is done for good. So I'm going to put down the controller, revel in an awesome victory, and say goodbye to all of you. This is JP of Channel 84 Winnipeg, signing off. Thanks for watching the finale of The Hard Path, and I'll see you when I show off the final secret level. Later.